Hi everyone, today I will be styling my dresser or you can call this a chest of drawers. I know some of us, most of us do have this item at home. I wanted just to create a beautiful space in my room. Since I don't have a budget to buy all the big furniture items for my bedroom, I thought, you know what, to inspire myself and motivate myself, let me just choose this small area to style. So I'm styling my dresser today. I'll be using what you call vignettes. Vignettes is just a fancy name that we use in decor to group items that work well together. So it's just arrangements. So I'll be using two arrangements on my dresser. And to anchor those arrangements, I'll use this art I got from Mr. Price home as a background. This can be what you call an anchor object. I'll just place it here in the middle. And the first tall object that I'll be using is this vase. This is an old vase that I had. It's broken as you can see. Um, and it even has a small crack here, but just to repurpose it, I decided to use it to start my dresser. So that's the first item I use. And I'll just add some uh, floral uh, arrangement here just to give the space some life. I opted to use um, some leaves. These are leaves that I got from artificial leaves from at home. And these ones I got from Mr. Price home. So I just grouped them together just to create an arrangement, I'll use this bubble plastic at the base so that it just sits well in the vase. <coughs> so that's the first object that I'll be using. And the second object is this beautiful <laughs> cocktail shaker that I got at Mr. Price home. When I saw this, I didn't even know what it was. It just attracted me because of the gold and the stone cap. So I'll be using it for deco. And the next object is this uh, beautiful dome I got also at Mr. Price home. It has dried flowers inside. <coughs> So that's the first vignette uh, or arrangement and see how it gets in so well with the background. So for my second arrangement, I'll be using a platter. So this is actually a plate that I spray painted gold. So to group a few small items, it is nice to use a tray or a platter. So that's what I'll be using this for. So I also have this frame. I got it as a gift at those work Christmas parties. I think it's pretty. And just arrange it over here. I have a candle, beautiful candle I got at home, etc. Just use it on the plate and this clear vase I had got from Mr. Price home with this nice pink rose or also got from Mr. Price home. So a tray or a platter like this you could use to put arrange your perfumes or put some of your jewelry uh, on your dresser. So this is how everything looks together. This is my two vignettes. It actually again creates a nice uh, contrast. Your eye can just go around. There's nothing flat. This is why in deco there's a rule of odds. They say if you could see here, I've got three items on a plate and I've got three items this side. So those are the odd numbers so that your eye can just travel around and everything is looks structured 
and it looks good on camera, on photos, even on your, when you look at it live. So this is how the decor for my dresser came out. Tell me what you think and tell me if you would be styling your own chest of drawer or dresser and let me know how it goes. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.